Okay guys, what's good? How you doing? I hope you are doing well. Welcome to Vinyl TV. If you are new to this channel and if you are, please consider subscribing. I will appreciate it. Thank you very much indeed for stopping by. Thank you very much indeed for clicking. This is Canon printer Isensi M30 MF3010 MF3010 This printer is lesser printer It's multifunctional printer It's multi-tax Triple in one In the sense you can copy Scan and print from this gear This printer is using Ink toner 725 Ink toner Ink toner starter Is included in the packaging this printer needs to be connected using USB cable connection. Unfortunately, USB cable is not included in the packaging. I'm going to show you what the USB cable looks like. We have this at Vinet Tech Store, free delivery here in UK. And this is the USB cable. USB cable is universal. Canon can use it. Epson can use it. HP can use it. Brothers can use it. I'm going to give you overview of this printer then show you how to set this printer up to your PC from the back here is the power cable three pin power cable is included two power cables is actually included in the packaging one is three pin and the other one is two pin the one right now is three pin and the USB cable goes right here okay the serial number for this printer is right here okay the serial number is here okay so the serial number is right here I'm going to turn this printer around here is the scanner flat bell scanner load your document you want to copy or scan stick it here and select the function from right here okay I'm going to lift this printer up this way so you open it up this and ink cartridges I mean the Toner is right here. Lift this up and check my video how we install the toner. Like I mentioned earlier, it's using Canon cartridge 725 starter is included. It's using ink toner 725. And it goes in here. It can print up to 18 prints per minute in terms of the, in terms of the printing speed. And it's black and white. So check my video how we install the toner. It goes in here, push it inside, okay, and gently close yeah, this cover and go to close, gently close the front panel as well. It's in. Now, this is the paper tray holder. Can load various sizes of paper. What we have here right now is A4 paper. It's what we loaded. I'm going to bring the camera for you to see. So what we loaded here is A4 paper. Okay, so you can load various size of paper, and what you need to do just adjust it with the holder. So what you have here is A4 paper. So you can load A5, B5, A4, liter, A6. Only what you need to do is go in straight in okay so go straight in okay and once it's in adjust it and bring this closer okay so right now this printer is pretty much what we need to do so also this goes in here push it in this way and bring it out so that the paper you are printing out will stay on top of it right here what i want to show you right now then you see this printer on and off this is the on and off button right here okay so you switch it on and off from here okay so this is canon isensi mf3031 now to set this printer up what we need to do is we need to bring our laptop okay I'm going to show you my laptop. My laptop hasn't got a place for you to stick the CD. There is three CDs that came with this printer. It contained the driver. But what we need to do right now, what I want to show you is how you can 
set this up even if your printer hasn't got where to put this okay what we need to do right now is first of all switch the printer on and make sure your PC is on as well now what we need to do is go to your startup so start your PC on okay so go to your window and you can use Google you can use Microsoft Edge okay any search engine what you need to do is go to Canon website canon.co.uk or canon.com if you live in US and once you're in Canon scroll and go to Canon website okay once you're in Canon website this is the Canon website okay now what we, I want you to look out for is we need to look out for is go to support so click you can see official store service and app get inspired click support okay once you click support the next thing we need to do is scroll once you click support download driver software and manuals so what you need to do right now is you can see to assess the content listed above and more including app fireware and frequently asked question error code please search for your product so right now what we need to do is we need to search for canon i sense sensei okay mf3010 okay so what we need what we're searching for canon i sense okay it looks like we can so type again mf three zero one zero here we go so we find it i sense it mf3010 select on it okay so what we need to do right now i can see available driver available drivers is up to 10. for certain product a driver is necessary to enable the connection between your product and the computer okay so what we need to do right now is select the window so window i sense it drivers okay click download here it is here so scan gear and this is released january 2021 okay this is individual driver but all we need to do is click download so everything windows 64 bit okay and um, version file version is f3901 release date like i said earlier january okay so se click, select download and once you select download agree to software terms and agreement click download And right now it's downloading you can see it's downloading okay it's in location and installing so you can see it's installing Okay, and the file is installed. Click it open. Right now, okay, it can Canon driver model. So you need to click yes. Once ask this question, click yes. Do you want to allow this app to make changes to your driver? Click yes. Okay, and you can see. Welcome to setup wizard. Okay, now the next thing you need to do is click next okay canon software license click yes agree to the license so like right now is okay copying of mf driver file is completed finish installation connect the printer to computer click exit okay finish to finish the installation connect the printer to computer using usb cable connection so right now we need to this is the USB cable. Okay. Now stick the USB cable to your printer. So, so turn this round. Okay. Stick this, push it inside. 
okay and it's in now the next thing we need to do is stick this inside you can see the noise it made, it made. okay once it's in it will recognize the printer recognize it okay now the next thing we need to do is click exit okay canon licensing click accept accept okay you can see it's telling us right now installation is complete so once you install the printer then you need to go to your settings okay go to your settings for your pc okay and what you need to do is go to bluetooth and device bluetooth and devices okay select bluetooth and devices and bluetooth and devices scroll down go to printer and scanner okay select printers and scanner select printers and scanner now what you need to do is you can see you can select add device but we already see canon mf3 so you go you go here because once you connect this printer to a wire to a usb cable and it recognize it so you can see select on it okay you can see printer statue is showing idle okay and so you can test print test page print open printer queue so here we go so right now you can see this printer is printing test page so to use the scanner for this printer so you need to add okay go to bluetooth and device okay scroll down and go to printer and scanner and you can see canon mf3010 is showing up okay and what you need to do you can see if you print test which you already done open printer queue okay now what we need to do is select, select printer property and once you select printer property you can see preference you show you this preference okay now the other thing i want us to do is close it go to scanner settings okay open scanner and it's showing us scanner you can see the, the scanner is right here showing up so it's already changed to mf3010 so if you want to scan a document now you can just need to stick the document you want to scan on top of the scanner okay and click scan And also change the document to PDF. Okay. Select scan. Okay, so from here select scan you can see right now the scanner is scanning it's processing okay and select view okay this is the document scan okay so you can see this is a document scan okay so this is how to set this printer up thank you